Hello and welcome to our video for today. We are focusing on the song Silent Night, played in the style of Lindsay Sterling. Um, for the purpose of this video, you might want to check out Lindsay's performance on her YouTube channel. And specifically, we're looking at the second part of the song as she's playing it. In the first half, she's actually doing more of a duet to her pre-recorded background overlap that's going on, and then she gets into the full powerhouse effect of playing the melody in the second half. So that's what we're looking at as far as notes and what I've sourced together by ear. Also, I won't be doing any vibrato, so it's a lot easier for you to see my fingers and not get lost trying to focus on the motion of note changes with that. And I don't have my normal tab system because, once again, Lindsay's playing style here relies on position shifts. We're going to be moving that hand out of its normal first position spot, so I will verbally walk you through the notes. At the end of the video, I have also put in a recording of me playing it at a sort of slower, medium-ish speed that you can also use as a reference. And I hope you've enjoyed the clip of my bird, Ringo, as my assistant today, just for filler. All right, let's get started. Okay, so to get started, she first plays a low two on E, followed by normal three, back to the low two, and crosses over to four on the A, like this. Then again. Now I have to do the big first position change of the day. We're going to take our first finger, put it where three normally goes, second finger where fourth finger goes, third finger right behind, and fourth stretches just a little bit. Try about where your body on your violin starts. And we're going to do four, four, two. Then we're going to do three, followed by two, three, two. Bring your first finger back to low two is. So we're through the first part. Now for the next line, we're going to do one here, high three, normal three, and then we're going to slide back just a little bit, like that. So then we're going to do two, one, two. Then three on A. She gets a little fancier on the next line. Starts with two, one. Then we're gonna slide up. Two or three is, then high three. Then four. Then we go back to high three. And then this one. And slide back. Then two, one, two, three. Next big position change, sliding back up like we did before, one on three, two on four, three right behind, stretch for that four, three, one, two again, but two is actually a three sharp this time, that four again, and then we go back to the two, three sharp. Now we're going to drop way back to one flat, then the three, then one again, high three on A, low two on A, regular one flat on A. 